Hey, good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Captain Taylor here with SaltyScales.com. So I'm doing my intro in reverse, guys. I apologize. I actually got super excited because I was coming out to target redfish this evening, and I forgot to do my intro, but I just landed a Mogan, and it's something special. So stay tuned, and you'll see it here. But what I'm doing today is I'm chunking uh, baits, so to speak, or dead sticking, and I'm chunking blue crabs, literally cutting them in half, deshelling them, and chunking them out and waiting on the bite to come to me. Now, if you're not familiar with how to rig blue crab for bait, take a look at this video right here, and this will show you everything that you need to know in order to, to use blue crab efficiently. So, hey, stay tuned for the action. It's a lot of fun. If you like the video, give a thumbs up, comment below, and subscribe. All right, guys, hooked up. Been waiting to get hooked up for some time now. Fishing with half a blue crab. Pretty sure this is the desired species that we're looking for, which is the redfish. Oh, he's got me way out there, guys. Way out here. Dead sticking is a very slow way to fish, guys. I've been waiting on this fish for about two hours. And I'm not exaggerating when I tell you that. I'm using a very light, light leader. Only 20 pounds. I'm telling you, this is a big fish. With nasty head shakes. He's not happy. <laughs> this is a battle here, guys. A big, big battle. I get a little bit, and he takes a lot. Oh, man. He is way out there. Holy smokes. Oh, he just cut across the top of the water, way out there. Holy smokes, what do we have here? Should be this big old redfish. Uh, I don't know. How hard he's pulling. Unless he's an absolute mogan. He's got me out, 75 yards. I don't want to put too much pressure on him because this is, like I said, a 20 pound leader. And that's the thing, you really don't have to. When you're open like this, in open water, you ain't got to horse him. Let the rod and the reel do the work. And then finesse him. Pull your rod back, reel down when you go forward. When he runs, let him run. Just keep the rod up. That's why I love these redfish. They, they go to the end. I just want to finesse him here. Already had a lot of strain on this light line. Don't want to do anything stupid after two hours of waiting on them. Ah, oh, he's not done. He is not done. God, 
God, he's shaking that head so hard. I want to at least see the darn thing. I want you guys to see it too. It's my luck I won't hook into another one this evening. Holy smokes. <laughs> Yo, yeah, baby. Love it. Oh, he's going again. Every time I get him even somewhat close to the vicinity of the bank, he's not having none of it. Come on, baby. Just come get your picture taken. I'm going to let you go. close now guys he is literally right here at the bank oh he is so oh my gosh look at the size of that redfish guys oh my gosh look at the size of this redfish guys it is an absolute moga oh no he's going oh don't wrap me around that pole oh crap 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 here for you guys my heart is racing so f oh my god look at the head on that redfish guy she's a mogan monster biggest redfish i've caught in a long 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 time Steph hold this rod keep pressure on her oh yeah she's been been holding her for a long time oh my gosh oh my gosh <laughs> guys guys <laughs> guys guys hang on she is Oh, if we go here, 38 inches, guys, and massive. Here, oh, guys, that is a redfish. Tilt it up a little bit. That is a redfish, guys. Oh. All right, let's do the revival. Holy cow. Guys, look at the size of this redfish. Absolute Mogan. I think she's ready. The Penn Spinfisher V3500. Equip that with a seven foot, six inch medium power St. Croix rod. This is the eight to 17 pound class. And I have 20 pound suffix braid on here, 832 I believe it is, and 20 pound fluorocarbon cigar with a two aught circle hook, and it's an owner hook. And I'm chunking half of these baits so that's the tackle and the gear that's being used this evening. <laughs> 